Hello guys, it's Shiori again. Today I'm going to answer your questions. You sent me on the Instagram and also the YouTube comment sections. Thank you for sending me a lot of the questions. And finally, 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 I'm going to drink this beer for the first time of this week. Yay! Um, I'm so excited to drink. Some people commented I was drinking the non-alcohol beer. Even though it's not technically beer, but maybe you feel like beer, so yeah, that's true. But anyway, let's start drinking and answering your questions. The first questions I got was, which drink I drink the first? Sapporo! Yay! Nice. Look at this yellow shiny thing. So Yes, beer is beer. It's definitely, definitely not the same as non-alcohol beer. Uh, the second question I'd like to answer is Have I ever tried the Czech beer before? The answer is no, but I found this Czech beer. And also I found this one, Budeyo Bitsuki Budoba. I hope I sound right. So I'm going to vlog about maybe me the daily basis thing and then try this beer. So please stay tuned for that. But thank you for sending me the recommendation of the beer. And also I got some questions about have I ever tried the American beer, Danish beer or European beer. In Japan, I think it's relatively easy to get those American uh, craft beer because a lot of the shops carry those things and then usually the cans design is so unique and nice so I personally love choosing uh, design over than the taste. For the Danish beer, I think uh, in Carlsberg is very easy to try in many restaurants actually. If you have any other brands recommendation please let me know. And the other questions I got was either European beer or Japanese beer. For this, it's really difficult to choose because I tried some of the European beer before but I think it's not enough to judge either European beer versus Japanese beer. But I like the Japanese beer, got some inspiration from Belgian white and then they are usually very nice. So someday I'd like to go to Europe trip, beer hunting trip to Belgium to try out the more white Belgian beer and German to try the real beer culture. I think if I do the beer hunting in German, I worry about my money more than my health. I got another question about do I drink just the amber and golden beer or I drink dark and stout kind of beer. Sometimes I drink the stout as well. I like drinking the stout beer with the sweet stuff. Uh, it's really up to my feeling, but I usually drink this kind of yellowish beer. What's great? Ibisu! Now they are selling the white bajon and it's so nice. I had that with no and it was so nice. <laughs> Japanese people consider this is a bit luxury beer. Usually when you say I only drink Ebisu, people consider oh you are rich kind of feeling. I noticed when I watched the Eba, the Misato only drinks Ebichu. <laughs> Ebichu is cute. She is earning good salary, obviously. She's commanded to save us, so she deserves this Ebichu. But sometimes in this bucket, there's the fish. I've never seen that before, but one day I think if I become like a Misato, I can maybe afford drinking Ebichu every day. Then it's going to be able to find them. I did the anime character test before and then my resemble character was the Misato. Maybe me and her are similar because clumsy, messy, and then a bit bossy. But I'm not good enough to be like super bossy to save us yet. So my character goal became like Misato. Anyway, this is the Abyss Beer. Oh, it's <laughs> The next question is, I got so many questions about this. Do I remember the first time I tried the beer? The answer is, I vaguely remember. I think my first time to try was the Kirin Ichiban Shibori. I tried a bit and then I thought, eh, this is not good. Why adults drink this all the time kind of feeling. Adults always do like, ah, 
kind of Sada effect they always make it. It sounds so delicious, right? But Tanda, it's not the best, so I was so surprised to taste, to be honest. It's not like first instant love. <laughs> it's not like that. I think the, the trigger, me being like the beer lover, is my previous job was very tough because working was quite crazy. But I had a really good seniors. So my senpais are all much older than me, so. They took me to a lot of the izakayas and then enjoy hanging out with them and then I started drinking beer outside more. That's how I became like a beer lover. Next! The best local beer I tried last year, 2020, I did a Furusato Noze which is you are paying a tax for the other local governments outside of my cities and then you can get some return for that. I chose five cities in Japan can get the beer return and then I could try many of the beer I found the one interesting local beer it's from Shimane prefecture and it's called a Yonotsu beer the packaging is so cute I got the two beers one beer is very stressy and nice the other one is made of the rice it was so unique and then very nice so it became my new favorite local craft beer for me even though i found something i really like i usually try to drink the new beer so for now my favorite one is the yunotsu but i think in half year later my favorite one will be changed next question is what's the best beer i've ever had it's so difficult to choose the one always always good to drink on the beach and the super super harsh sun this beer is the best and also when you watch the baseball game it's always good i think the answer is more like the environment me under the sun while doing something fun and have the really really good cold beer that's the best <laughs> yes uh, companies are the best place to find new and interesting beers or grocery shopping place is better? The answer is uh, grocery shopping places like supermarket is always better because the company sections are quite small. Supermarket has more bigger sections like I showed you in the beer hunting video. So I recommend you to run to the supermarket than convenience store. I will drink this one. Mm, it is so good. The Rencon chips. Some people ask me about my favorite snacks while I'm drinking. I like the the veggie chips, the cheese sandwich, mozzarella cracker, and wasabi jagareko. Is there a sake I like as well? The answer is sake. I'm not drinking sake much. I recently tried the Dewasakura from Yamagata with Natsuki when we are filming the JR video for TC Play it was so good Natsuki sneakily ordered Dewazakura when Japanese people pour the sake usually it's overflowing and then even in the plate has the sake kind of things I thought it's no good idea to drink because after I go back to the hotel I need to work a bit and then next day we have filming so but at the same time I want to enjoy the drinking time with Natsuki because he ordered for me so I tried and then it was so good so I drank all no problem people said if you drink the good alcohol you don't get hungover I think that story is true okay this is my last drink questions Shuri, do you like hard cider? Okay, this question is actually interesting because when I heard the hard cider, I was like, mm, what's that thing about again? Kind of feeling because at least for me, uh, hard cider is not familiar term for drink. But I found this one from my fridge. My husband bought, which is called sh Shidoru. I think this is the French, but it's the same thing, right? Hard cider and this one, I googled it and then I think this is the same thing. So this is the Melusian's Shido. It's really nice and refreshing. I think if I try the real UK's hard cider, I think I would love it. But I've never tried them before, unfortunately. Please let me know what brand is good and what's the easiest thing to get. 
But hey, that's all about the drinks. Okay. While I'm drinking this Asahi beer, I'm going to answer the questions about food. This is one of my favorite questions. What's my favorite Malaysian food? Why I'm answering these questions because my husband is from Malaysia and I love Malaysian food. If I nominate the food I like, there's so many. Nasi Rama, Chakri Tiao, Nasi Kanda, Kari Laksa, Bak Teh, Roti Chanai. So far, anything I tried in Malaysia, I love them all. Only the durian is the things I cannot appreciate at all. My Malaysian level is not there yet. I cannot chew and suck up the old seed nicely for the dream. <laughs> Next question. What food and drink would you recommend most from a Japanese convenience store? For food, I would say onigiri and any hot snack. Especially the 7-Eleven Harumaki Spring Roll is good. So please try that. For drinks, I recommend you guys to check out the sections, not the pet bottle area. I recommend you guys to check out the coffee and the break pack sections because there are so many soy juice, uh, yogurt drinks. So And also these drinks are all seasonal stuff so you can find really new things and fun to check out the sections. Next! Finish! I'm going to drink the Brio Miru. How has it been recently for me and Tokyo Creative? The answer is all great. New CEO of Tokyo Creative is the Tima. He is my colleague. Has been working together for three years together. We got a lot of the deals because sales tips are great. We were a bit busier than usual. So there are so many pros and cons. We are trying to see the work and life balance together. <laughs> okay, next. A lot of people said that Oreo meat is easy to drink. I think so too. I just want to go back to Okinawa and then be my grandma. I miss her so much. Next beer I'm going to introduce you is... Ta-da! Sampli Kaorele. This one is very good. The smell is so... Fruity and nice. Mm. It's pretty good. I'm not a big fan of the normal premium molds to be honest. Normal premium molds and the uh, ABC beer. Japanese people see them are like the a slightly luxury version beer compared to Sapporo Kuro Label, Kirin Ichiban Shibori, and Asahi beer. <laughs> I just made the miso soup. This time the Guzai. The ingredients are chikwa, the fish cake, and the tofu. But anyway, the last question is if we are going to do the meetup event or not? The answer is of course, we would love to. We cannot do anything yet, so we are also waiting for the moment it's going to be okay. One day, I would like to see you guys in person while you are traveling to Japan. So hopefully this situation is going to be getting better. Anyway, that's my last questions I answered and hopefully my answers are either helpful or interesting for you guys. I couldn't answer the all questions while I'm drinking beer so I'm going to continue having the same format while I'm drinking beer and answering your questions for next week as well so please stay tuned for that. Thank you for sending a lot of the questions. I personally enjoyed this video. Anyway, I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye bye! I'm going to I'm going to take a nap after this. <laughs>